so I'm doing an unboxing of the ball carp sofa bed from Ikea. Now, I only found one review on this, um, on this sofa bed. And, um, yeah, I wanted to put something out there for some people who want it and not sure they want to buy it or not. So, this is what it looks like. Now, I wanted, it's kind of dark in here. Let's see. This is what it looks like. I got the one in black, but it comes in two colors. Let me see if I can pull this out so it'll be a little bit more lit in here. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Okay, so quick story. I bought this when I was at Ikea. Now, I measured it. It's one thing when you buy bulk items from Ikea. I went online and I checked the measurements. And so here are the measurements for the package. So the package is, the width is 40 and a half inches. The height is seven and one fourth inches. The length is 68 inches and the pounds is 77. Okay, so when I went in to Ikea, those package dimensions is different than what's online. On the little label, all everything was increased. So I'm like, oh, is this gonna fit in my car? If you have a small car, I have a Hyundai. I have a Hyundai accent. And I thought sure that this this thing would fit in my car. It didn't fit. So the nice people out at IKEA, they took it out of the package for me. And then they tried to fit it in a car that way. It didn't fit. <laughs> now, mind you, I, I measured this. I am actually measured to make sure that it would fit in there. And I thought, sure, that I'll be able to just push the box in. Because lengthwise, it'll fit in a car. But widthwise, it didn't. So, word out to people who got small cars. If you got small cars, this is not going to fit. So, how did I get it home, right? Okay, so, IKEA has things for everything. They took it out of the package, which is how it is. They took it out, and they have these things. They're like cords, where you can tie things down on the top of your car, right? I didn't think about that. So if you have bulk items and you have a small car, they can put it on top of your car. You can buy these straps for seven bucks, and it'll strap your stuff down. You just take it home, and that's what I did. So. It's not put together. Right now it's sitting directly on the floor. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to put it together. Um, the legs are underneath um, inside the frame. So that's what I'm about to do. And I'm going to stick you guys on the tripod. And then we're going to... I need to get some light in here because it's too dark. Flip it up and then see. The frame is underneath, under there. three straps holding the frame together and here are the screws they're like just giant bolts there are four of them and they also give you um some washers in here and also some um the wrench the tool to go with it and so all i'm doing is cutting away these these little plastic Restraints.
just screwing the legs together, that's it. Now this, this sofa bed, it, it retails for 109 and that's the reason why I got it because I needed something perfect that'll fit perfectly under the Ikea, um, what is the name of this bunk bed? Uh, Strava bunk bed and it fits, my son he wanted a couch that would fold down into a, um, a little bed if his company comes over. So this is perfect, it's perfect and it's cheap. Okay. So let me show you guys what the bolts and the legs look like. Okay, so this is what the legs look like. They're really long. And what the other one looks like. So now I'm gonna flip this over, cause now I'm done. It don't this 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 is like the easiest thing you can put together, cause it already it comes together pretty much. All you're doing is put the legs on, and that is it. What it looks like. This is what it's looking like. Put the legs on it. Really nice. I also picked up some pillows to decorate it. Blue ones. And um, and those pillows from IKEA are like three ninety nine. Oh no, yeah, three ninety nine. Really cheap pillows. So, now I'm going to show you guys how it goes down. How it flips down into a bed. You push it forward, it goes down. And that is it. And go straight down. And then. All done really nice and the comfort level let's see the comfort level is really firm but 
you don't want your guests to stay here that long anyway, do you? <laughs> this is just something for somebody to stay over for the night and then they go home. So yeah, the comfort level is like, it's, a, it's really firm. And I don't want to say hard because it, it does have some type of cushion to it. But it's really good. It's a review video for the the ball carp um, sofa bed. Uh, whew, that wore me out. <laughs> so, okay. Well, thank you for watching. Peace.